We are live backstage at Stagecoach with the awesome Dirk Spentley! Let me do the 18th million person to congratulate you for your big baby news, man. No, thanks, man. Yeah. Number three. I think we're, we're good after that. Cover. Do you know? Don't know yet. Don't yeah. know. Are you going to find out? Oh, yeah. Definitely going to find out. Because you want a boy, don't it's you? It's a girl. If, well, <laughs> if country music, if country music uh, you know, lore holds true with Alan Jackson, McGraw, and Garth, and Toby Key, there's a lot of guys with three girls out there. That's what I'm so. saying. It's a girl, dude. We'll see. I have two daughters. You have two daughters. You're about to. Have I rolled the dice. Did I rolled the dice for uh, just on the third to see nice. what happens. So I'm you excited. Want, you want a boy, don't you? Man, I just want the company policy here is we just want a healthy baby. <laughs> we all know that. <laughs> and that healthy baby will go to the bathroom standing up. <laughs> It's okay to say that. I got a daughter that does that right now, anyway. So. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to teach her to be you know, comfortable outside, you know, go in the woods. I'm glad that you brought up kids um, because John and I do something on our show called uh, John and Tammy's Wall of Peer and Shame. Nice. Which we're the founding members of. Nice. Good for Because you. we've all done things that were like. Can't yeah, I did that. You know, leave, you leave your child in the car where you run into the liquor store. Exactly. Well, you know, <laughs> after the casino. Yeah. <laughs> but actually, we, we have some great stories that um, our listeners have shared, like the mom who accidentally sent her son to school in her pants, so he went to school in mom jeans. Wow. And nice. so, is there something that you can think of that would induct you into the parent world? Yeah, I have, have to work on it. Um, you know, the only four and two right now, so no room for too many big errors at this point. Um, they're, they're good, man. They're really sweet girls, man. They love their dad, and I have a good time with them. I'll, I'll think of something while we're talking. Okay. All right. Back to Sounds you. good. When either of them find your magazine collection, <laughs> would, you, would you call us? Please we'll give you our number. You don't have to do it right now. Oh gosh, are they going to go? On the, are they going to go on the bus? <laughs> <laughs> the bus is off limits. No. Yeah. No. No number. Two Daddy's on the bus. bus. No. And they are no uh, little kids in the bus. They're great, man. They are. Fun. They, you know, they come out on the road and they hang out with the guys and the crew and all the tattoos and the road life. They're, you know, they're my four-year-olds. She's she'll get up and stage and sing some now and then, so she's getting used to be on the road. They love it. Yeah, yeah. I bet they do. So they're not here today. It's a little hot, we're, but the crowd's crazy, bit. man. I mean, I was looking out there. I think the stage goes needs, needs a new slogan: beer, boots, and bikinis. It's everywhere. That's all you see. The three Bs. It's you warm. did say boots. <laughs> boots. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, and and before the sun goes down. Okay. Before, while the sun's still up, rather. Obviously, you know, red, white, and blue. That 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 works pretty well. Beer, beer boots, and. and Boots. Bikinis. <laughs> Beers, bikinis, and boots. Then I just forget bikinis. <laughs> so you've been traveling. She threw me off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she always does. She was thinking beyond the bikini. <laughs> so she's right. seeing through the bikini. Yeah. You were? Good for you. Know, she's more of a guy than I am, unfortunately. <laughs> so you've been all over America, obviously, like everybody who's been here, and they've all been saying the same thing. We're so psyched to get into this kind of weather because it's winter yeah. everywhere else, essentially, except Southern California. Yeah, and so, I love it. I mean, I'm from, I'm from Arizona, so I spent a lot of time in San Diego growing up. Mission Beach, Pacific Beach. <laughs> Uh, I'll just tore it up in the summer. One of those zonies that came over and uh, all the San Diego's wanted, San Diegoans wanted us to leave, but we came over in the summer to go. So I love it. I love the weather. I miss it. I'm glad to be out here. It's never going to be too hot for me. Last time we talked to you, you were mentioning a place, I think in PB, for a carne asada taco or something. No, taco, taco, taco surf. Yeah? Or is, yeah, it's a Baja taco. I think it's taco surf. Yeah. Okay. PB, yeah. So we're really still good. relatively new, so you recommend that? That place is great. The cheese shop down on La Jolla. All right. There's money. That place is going right. to go there. I crave that. Ah, oh, it's so good. So why don't you move out here, man? It's a little difficult, man. The whole industry revolves around Nashville. I mean, it's really quality of life. If you want to be close, see your family, and and, and I mean, you just have to be there because all the studios and the guys that write songs with, the musicians, the buses, the semis, every, everything's based out of that town. But Dirk Bentley 12 years ago could say that. You're, you're Dirk Bentley now, dude. I mean, you can. they would come to you. Well, we could just I cut did. out some of the states in between, you know, kind of pull... Nashville a little bit closer, you know. I, I think John's trying to do one of two things. Want to hang? Either, either, <laughs> either you're inviting him to move into your house with you, nice. which would be a little cramped, or he's suggesting that you buy a beach home so that Sweet. he can come See, visit you. And I'm not like, there. Be your maintenance man. Yeah, that'd be nice. <laughs> Get a house right there in Mission. That'd be pretty. That's enough. Favorite guys ever. <laughs> Thank you guys. Yeah. Congratulations on your, on your number three uh, daughter and um, boy. I can't, wait. I can't wait to watch your show tonight. Man. Thank you guys. I really appreciate it. It's going to be a great night. I've always, it's always an honor to be out here. It's always fun as, as hell and people are crazy, so it's going to be great. All right. Next time you're here, we'll do brunch at the world famous edition. Yeah, right, yeah, man. Love yeah, that love place. Right. Real place. Awesome. All right. All right. Bye, Dirks. We're going to edit out the line about the veterans. We yes, all, it will all be out.